Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Clay Knives, back again with another Let's Play of Vagrant Story. Last time we defeated the Stone Golem in a blow for blow, toe to toe battle between a rock, sinew, steel, and blood. He was defeated. And now Ashley Wyatt will toss aside all metaphor because this is a man of very few words and continue to make his way through the dungeon of Lea Monde. We are outside the Sanctum, and we are going to continue to attempt to make our way into the town proper. Let's go. And this is a bit unexpected. A dragon. A mother effing dragon. Alright. Key with the dragon is to always get in close so it doesn't use its fire breath. We have our 18 affinity rusty nail on, so we are gonna have at it. Go for the neck. What is this? We're just thinking like crazy. I apologize for this profusely. I don't know if this is going to work in post. This is most unfortunate. I have to apologize right now because this dragon is apparently breaking the emulator. It's so powerful and so out of hand that the emulator cannot handle the sheer width and speed of this dragon. Anytime I go in for chain. Shh, Nikes. Here comes the whip. Die, dragon, die! We're gonna continue to hit this dragon. This is not King's Quest or Kakari Freak. There are no puzzles to solve here. This is merely toe to toe dragon slay. Yes. The risk is getting a little high. So we can't falter, we can't falter in our quest, we have to continue to strike with everything we have, because if we don't, we'll die. And death, as you know in video games for us, is very simple. We just reset the game, boot up from the save point, but for Ashley, it'll be eternal. Because the Ashley that survives this dragon would exist in a parallel dimension, separate from the Ashley who died here. So as a result, I like this Ashley personally, he hasn't died yet, and I would like to, well at least on camera. I'd rather like to attempt to keep him alive. Damn. Uh, I'm gonna use a veil right here. Lower that risk. A miss! A palpable miss! Alright, actually. Let's, let's block this tail attack this time. He's hurting. It's alright. This Ashley Riot, he's learned a little magic. And you know what? I'm a bit of a fool, so let's do it now. He may be saying, Clay, where's the Prostasia? And I'd be saying, well, I'm a bit of an idiot, so it hasn't been put on yet. But now that we got this equip up, let's do some serious, serious damage. 
Why is the game glitching so bad? <laughs> this computer's just had it. It's just had it. There's some bosses where there's two bosses in the same screen with you, and if you get to that and it doesn't go well, it could be a bit of a problem. This guy's... I don't want to lower his strength because I want to try and block some of his attack. Oh, this is what we didn't want. We've gotten out of the circle of his range. He's going to hit me with the hot, stinky breath, which may have killed me, and it did. And Ashley has died on camera. And we're going to leave that death in there as a warning. The warning as to what can happen in this game. Uh, how much HP does that dragon have? I was. Did you see that? I was wailing on him. Alright, let's try this again. Ashley, you died. You're gonna be punished for that. <laughs> oh, Ashley. Let's keep those suicidal tendencies in check, buddy. We got a long way to go here. Let's do a couple loops. Let's kick open the door. Let's only open one. We're gonna surprise the dragon. Well, how it's just like sleeping in the corner, as if to say, hey. This is a dragon hole. I thought this was a church. No, this is a dragon hole. Alright, first things first. I'm gonna get Prestige on right off the bat. I don't want to cast Degenerate because I want to reflect back a lot of what he's doing. So, however, we'll go look at our defense arts. We do have fireproof. And we're gonna put that right there. Let's go. Let's have the game glitch as much as we possibly can. Why? Why is the game glitching so badly? This is horrible. And it's only when I'm like right under the dragon. And it's messing up my chains is the problem. See, it's messing up my chains. I'm losing the rhythm. This is horrible because there are so many dragon fights in this game. Here comes that tail attack. Why can we not block that? gonna have to go with the slowdown. I sincerely apologize for this, but it's gonna have to be dealt with because apparently I have a computer that can't handle anything over Commodore 64. He's messing up my chains so bad. Horribly rendering the fight. The dragon is able to slow. I disagree heartily with that game. That did not happen. There is no way I missed that tail attack. That is completely and utterly impossible. This dragon is complete and utter. You know what we're going to call this? We're going to call this bull hinky right here. We're going to call this Gotham City on a Friday night. We're going to call this waking up in Omaha when you were supposed to be in St. Louis. 
We're going to call this every kind of nonsense you can possibly think that Sydney summoned a dragon that could break my emulator. And here comes his tail attack. Watch. Perfect timing. Nope. Game's going to sound slow. It's not like we're not doing damage to him, though. Can't... Oh, he's dead. I thought we did that much damage in half last time we fought it. Hi, I'm a computer. I can't handle PS1 graphics, plus fraps. I got a computer that's six years old. Hi! Yeah, give me some bonus. Yeah. My least favorite thing I wanted. Yeah, that's pretty useful. That's useful. In fact, I'm good at all. In fact, we're gonna use a bunch of it right now. Um, no target range. We will use the uh, elixir saints given to Saint Iacus by the seven wise men of Oligo. We're gonna use that. We're gonna use that and be awesome. Slow the game down, be a little more awesome. Let's cast a little heal. Hopefully we'll get a cutscene now and the game will just cease to function completely. This game is never giving me this much trouble. It is being real sketchy today. Look at this, I can't even circle the room. Let's just go through the door. Where are we? Where the hell are we? We're at an exit. I could go back and save it, but you know, I'm feeling real bold and we're not going to do that. Town proper. Here we go. Lea Monde. Well, just a workshop, nothing else here. We still know where it from Squad 3. They're dead then. I... I could not... Did you not verify their corpses? Sir... So, so my apologies, but... Coward, you are a stain on the escutcheon of our order. Escutcheon, Dwayne, Dwayne, so full of himself, so righteous. Ah, your death's gonna come rather quickly and unexpected, my friend. But I digress. The loss of our brothers cannot be helped. Pray that fate will not be as cruel a mistress to us. Search! The rat hole Mullenkamp's been using is here somewhere. Leave no stone unturned. Sir. I, for one, cannot leave this accursed city soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> 